Hi guys, I'm glad to be here again with another video. Thanks so much for always coming back to watch my video. I sincerely appreciate it. Uh, the Nigerian under 20 women's national team, the faculty, they were in Dar es Salaam earlier today playing in the under 20 women world, I mean women world qualifiers, World Cup qualifiers, and uh, the match ended in a one-all draw. But before I give you the details of that match, let me quickly welcome you to this channel. It's a pleasure to have you. If you are here for the first time, it's a channel to be. Thank you for coming. Please kindly subscribe to the channel. If you think it's a channel you can relate with, I will appreciate it greatly. And to all my amazing subscribers, the new and the returning subscribers, thank you so much for your love and your support. Please watch the video to the end. Give me a thumbs up and share the video. Thank you very much. All right, let's go straight into it. Under 20 Women World Cup qualifiers, Falconet. Play the 1 1 draw with Tanzania. It was an away match for Nigeria. Nigerian Falconet had Tanzania to a 1 1 draw away in the first leg. Third round of the 2024 FIFA Under 20 Women's World Cup qualifiers on Sunday. Chioma Olise opened the scoring for the Falconet. In the 68th minutes of the game, but Tanzania equalized thanks to Asna Ubamba, who netted in 71st minutes through a very superb uh, free kick. Guys, the second match, I mean, the second leg, will take place inside the Moshud Abiola Stadium in Abuja on Sunday, the 19th. November 2023. That is in a week's time. The Falconet advances to the third round through a walkover after Mauritius withdrew proud to the first leg. Four teams will represent Africa at the 2024 FIFA Under 20 Women's World Cup in Colombia. And the all hands will be on deck for Nigeria to qualify for that 2024 under 20 women's world cup at the, at the 2022 under 20 women's world cup the falconers got to the quarter final stage before they lost to netherlands by 2-0 well they need to qualify first before we can talk about the World Cup is served uh, properly. So they still have a lot of work to do. All right. They play 1-1 one, one draw in uh, Dar es Salaam earlier today. And they have opportunity now to upstage the Tanzania and qualify for the next stage. All hands must be on deck as they Prepare for the second leg coming up on Sunday, next week, Sunday. Okay, thank you so much for always coming back to watch the video. Please, if you have any comments on this, I'd like you to please put it down on the comment section. I will appreciate it. What do you think the faculty should do, should do as it gets ready for the second leg of the of the of the game with uh, uh, Tanzania under 20 women's team. Okay, Nigeria Falcon will be playing, you know, with their fans, Nigerians watching at Abuja, and uh, I think this is a great opportunity for them with the backing of the of the fans. Well, the table should be turned and then uh, they should win. Awesomely for them to get to the 
next stage of the qualifying series. Thank you very much one more time for your love and your support. I sincerely appreciate it. If you have not subscribed to the channel, kindly subscribe to the channel, press the notification bell so that you'll be notified each time I post new videos. I cannot but thank all my missing subscribers. Please keep on watching, keep on keep, keep on uh, supporting and keep on sharing our video. Guys, if you can dream it, you can achieve it. Every achiever start, started with a dream. Dream it, achieve it. It is possible. If others could, you can also. Take good care of yourself. Be the best you can, whatever you do. Consider yourself a greatness. Till I come your way next time with another video, I'd like to say to you guys, bye-bye.